What's up guys, Atom Bacon here, welcome back to more Pokemon Crystal. In the last episode, we restored the power plant and took on gym leader Misty. And in this episode, we are going to make our way back to Lavender Town and see if we can get anything for restoring the power. <laughs> because when we went to the radio station, <laughs> the man was going on about how the power is out and he can't do anything. So now that it is on, maybe we can do something. But on the way by, I want to explore Saffron City a bit more. Because we didn't really give this place much time. <laughs> Who are you? You are me. Hi! I heard that you lost your favorite Poké doll. If I find it, you'll give me a rail pass? Then I'll go find it for you. You think you lost it when you went to Vermilion City? Pardon? I shouldn't decide what you should do. But I'm really worried. What if someone finds it? Going to the radio tower can wait. I think we should go help find this girl's doll. If you remember when we ver the very first time we arrived in Vermilion City, we went to the Pokemon fan club. Actually, I cut that out, so no you don't. And <laughs> there was a man there who had a doll resembling a, um, resembling a Clefairy. So I think we should go check that guy out. Fire Blast! No quarter for the wicked. Damn it, Joey. <laughs> so, yeah, those two trainers there were about. I skipped there. I went ahead and skipped those two trainers because they each only had one Pokemon. They really weren't difficult. I'm gonna go ahead and heal while I'm here in Vermilion. Now, actually, the guy to the right there. I want to talk to him briefly. If he's who I think he is. <laughs> if he is, I really should talk to him when I first arrived in Vermilion, but let's see. Nope, never mind, you're useless. <laughs> now, if we could cut the uh, Pokemon fan club. This guy's got the Clefairy doll. <laughs> I love Clefairy, but I could never catch one, so I'm making do with a polka doll that I found. Oh, I see now. The girl who lost this polka doll is sad? Okay, could you take this doll back to that poor little girl? I'll befriend a real Clefairy on my own one day. No worries. We got the Clefairy. Before we head back, though, I want to challenge this gym. You got this gym. Now, this gym was infamous for having a really annoying puzzle, but in this game, that puzzle is nowhere to be found. You can actually just waltz straight to the gym leader if you want to. Well, you're gonna have to fight a couple of these trainers along the way, but you don't have to solve any annoying puzzle. Big improvement over the first game. Tell Vincent. Magnemite! That's easy. <laughs> it's only level 27. Voltorb. Faint attack should do him in. Alright, yeah, Voltorb doesn't have a gender. Has a rollout, though, that's good. Er, well, good for it, anyway. Doesn't make a difference to me. Even if he did get a crit? <laughs> so close. Another Magnemite! 
I am curious how far away I am, but... Well, actually, I think I can check. No, not pack. Um, I think I can check, actually. Yeah, I can. 52 experience away. And Magnemite goes down. Yuki grows to level 35. Yeah, Yuki is almost fully leveled up now. N well, by fully leveled up, I mean caught up to the team. Like, she's only seven levels away. When I caught her, she was over 20. So, yeah, like, it really doesn't take long for the thing to catch up. And we get immediately spotted by another trainer. And I missed the Fire Blast. This could get dangerous, actually. Come on! Yes! Okay. <laughs> I don't know. If this doesn't kill, then I have to switch out. But... Come on! So close! <laughs> I was hoping for the burn. Um... Crystal! <laughs> I haven't used Mulan much in... <laughs> Oh well. She'll get her time. Yeah, big difference in damage there. <laughs> I'm just gonna let Crystal stay in on this one. <laughs> Misses the first thing. attack. Good job. Ten stars. And I get a crit. RNG did not like that electrode. If I had a crit there, that would have been really funny. Exact same turn. This guy literally, literally just has four electrodes. Like, what are you even, what are you even doing with your life? At least, at least this one can land the attack. One more trainer. <laughs> and we sent out a Pikachu. And I take a Pikachu. Probably should have healed. Never mind, doesn't matter. Flaffy, this is different. Huh. 
I love Fire Blast. It's honestly one of my favorite moves in the game. It's just so satisfying. I'm gonna go heal. I'll meet you right back here. And we are here at the gym leader. Hey, you little tyke. I have to hand it to you. you... It may not be very smart to challenge me, but it takes guts. When it comes to electric Pokemon, I'm number one. I've never lost on the battlefield. I'll zap you just like I did my enemies in war. Gym leader, Lieutenant Surge. Starts off with a Raichu. I don't think Yuki can do much of anything against this, so I'm gonna switch into Crystal. <laughs> Ooh, I'm glad I switched when I did. Whew. Thunder is very powerful. It's basically the electric version of Fire Blast. Same power, slightly lower accuracy, actually. However, un Thunder may have lower base accuracy, but its accuracy is made 100 in the rain, whereas nothing can ever increase Fire Blast accuracy. Well, I mean, there's the usual things, like raising your accuracy stat, lowering the enemy's evasion, things like that. But there's no like special conditions like there are for Thunder. Knows about the time I'm glad I have. Alright, sure, land a fire blast through the double team. Nice work, Yuki. Not quite a lunch up. And I get the burn. Beautiful. Crap. Ooh. <laughs> I'm also really surprised Yuki lived that. Okay. <laughs> I believe this Electrode has the exact same moveset. I'm going to switch into... I'm going to switch into Mulan, actually. Mulan hasn't really gotten much action. Going for the double team again. Screech. Electrode goes down, not too difficult. Next is a Magneton! That one's all yours, Dookie. I'm just getting really lucky with those fire blasts. I haven't missed very many of them. <laughs> and a critical hit, speaking of luck. And last Pokemon is an Electabuzz. I'm gonna stay in to get a bit of experience. And level 46, I'm going to give that one to Crystal. Once again, Crystal takes the Thunders. Yuki grows to level 37. Lieutenant Surge was defeated. 
And we receive the Thunder Badge. So with that in hand, I say we go give the polka doll back to that girl. Yay, that's my Clefairy polka doll! <laughs> see the t see the tear where its right leg is sewn on? That's proof. Okay, here's the magnet train pass like I promised. We, we received the da -da 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 -da. the pass for the magnet train. <laughs> so if the magnet train takes you between Saffron City and Goldenrod City. And unlike the SS Aqua, which only sails on certain days and you have to sleep to make it go right away, the Magnet Train is a quick zip there and back that you can access whenever you want. It's instant fast travel between the two regions. And so, that's your way of getting back and forth now. So if you have stuff you need to do in Johto, feel free to do it. There are some things we can go back and do, but I don't know if we're going to. Now, if... now that she's helped, let's go and get the... Hmm? Well, the... Alright, we're back in Lavender Town. See if, if we will get anything good for talking <laughs> to him now that we've restored it. Ah, so you're the atom who solved the power plant problem. Thanks, you. I never lost my job. I tell you, you're a real lifesaver. Please, take this as my thanks. You get the expansion card. <laughs> that thing, you can tune into the radio programs here in Kanto. <laughs> And yet, international calling is still free. <sighs> now that we have the expansion card, I think we should go challenge the Snorlax, because when we walk up to it, go into our Poke Gear, go to the very end, we have the Poke Flute. And who do I want in the front for this? I'm actually... Mm, I'm gonna put a Pileys in the front. Kigiro's place in the sleeping Snorlax. Snorlax woke up. <laughs> Big bad Snorlax. He's level 50. This thing is no slouch. If you have a hard hitting fighting type, <laughs> highly recommended for this. The Snorlax is also carrying leftovers. And does the move Snore. So... <laughs> putting to sleep doesn't mean it's instantly free of being able to... It free of, putting it to sleep doesn't mean it can't move. So... And it knows the move Rest, so it can put itself to sleep, too. So you want to try to knock it down quickly. Because it has pretty good sustain. And I missed the snore. Or, I, I missed the fly. Um. Hmm. <laughs> if it stays asleep just a little bit longer, that would be great, but I have low hopes. And it woke up. Oh, it went for rollout. Cool. Hadley's use fly. 
What's it gonna go for? <laughs> Roll out again. Okay, I'm okay with that. <laughs> that does a lot of damage, though. Okay. It's locked into rollout, so hopefully I can put it to sleep again. No. No, this isn't good. This isn't good. I need to put it to sleep. <laughs> oh, jeez. I, I need to land this hypnosis. Thank you, Apollos. I need to stay asleep. You can catch the Snorlax. And if, if you have multiple Pokemon that you want to have leftovers on, it might not be a bad idea to catch it. Oh dear. Uh-oh. Um, okay. Now, actually, I'm gonna have all of you Sweet Scent so that I can land my Hypnosis without <laughs> needing to worry. Snorlax is evasion fell. Still asleep. Oh, I did get the nightmare off. Okay, for some reason I thought I didn't. And one more sweet send. Mm. Is asleep. I should be able to actually just knock it out next turn with a razor leaf, actually. Yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna go for the Razor Leaf here. It didn't kill. Okay, it stays asleep. It stays asleep. We're good. I was worried about... I, I thought about using a Revive to bring back a Pileas. But my main concern was I didn't want a Pileas... Or I didn't want the Snorlax to wake up and use Rest that turn. So... We have that defeated, and we have a lot that we can do now. So, I'm going to heal up and end this episode off here. Next episode, I'm actually going to go back to Celadon City, because there's more stuff I want to do that way. We'll see you guys then.